There's a friend of mine and ito Mark. Uh -huh. Alikuwa yeye ufanya sana sana ndio alikuwa mambo ya recording and all that. Okay. Akaniambia, "Eh hey bro, niaje hii kamera yangu iko hapa kuna watu wanaichezea." Mm. So ni kwa suitcase mali ndio because najua wewe naweza ku trust nayo mm. haitapotea. So nikakaa nayo a month, mm. kuna siku nikaamka asubuhi nikaanga living nikasema, "Ah, labda naweza piga picha hata siko najua ni feature about it." Mm. Hello everybody, welcome to Sanana Mitilo. Remember we air every Wednesday at 8 p.m. And today we finish the series of Kenya's finest photographers. And in the house today, tunamaliza na guest ule munoma kama kawaida venye tunasemanga, tunaletanga the best of the best. And in the building today, I have none other than Sadiq. Sadiq, karibu sana kwa show. Sante sana, sante sana msibarak. Eh, karibu sana, we are excited to have you. Thank you. Uh, so maybe someone is watching you for the very first time. Tume cheki kazi zako. We'll be showcasing some of your work on the show. But maybe mtu hajui kazi yako na hajui uh, what you do. You can introduce yourself. Okay. Yes. Yeah. My name is Sadiq Sumba. Mm -hmm. I am a photographer, a videographer, kidogo, mm -hmm. an editor, designer, and everything to do just with creative. Mm -hmm. I'm a script writer, mm -hmm. a poet, and all those mm -hmm. in, in, uh, in tail, uh, just creative work and entertainment. Mm. Yeah. Nice, nice. See when you full package. Are you still single? Na na watetea watu wangu. So, uh karibu sana. We are excited to have you. So maybe uh, we would like to know you now from Palchini. Kwenye hii story yote ilianzia. Okay. Were you always artistic as a child? You can start with that. Yeah, me and me kwani kifanya art for long for eh, long. Eh, nilianza nilianza na drama festival of course. Okay. Watu wanzi hapo shuleni. Eh, so that is back in 2004 nikiwa primary. Wow. Eh tulikuwa tuna St Peter's boys eh, Mumias. Eh, eh. Yeah. Was it a boarding school? Yeah, boarding school but ni day and boarding. Day and boarding. So me nilikuwa the scholar cuz it's just oh. eh, karibu na home so eh. ilikuwa it was easier for me. So basically you are always artistic from childhood. Yeah, look out on a drama and all that and my mom used to support me so much. Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh nice. So primary you some St. Peter's. Where did you go to high school? High school kwa Chavakali High School. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, but uh it has a drama from three. Form three. Yeah, because mm -hmm. in uko the standards that were in primary was... <laughs> so high that San Kifika High School Lilinda and Angalia Hall Pata. Is in a book because they were not that good oh, okay. until form three. And you can put now a new director and you can do a whole corner. Now, this is a serious person I can work with because oh, nice. you can waste your time. Young, you participate in something, yes. Then, in Africa, uh, the first or the second level, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. so I chose to do other activities. I like football, kidogo, rugby, cooking, beer, cooking, beer. All this, you form one, skuma, nini, nini, all those things. <laughs> Yeah. Hey, from one, from two, uh -huh. yeah, then from three, you can uh, join uh, uh, drama festival. Drama, yeah. Uh -huh. But Chavakali is really known for uh, sports, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, sport, kidogo, handball, kidogo, uh -huh. rugby, likuwa, lakini, but major, likuwa ni choir. Oh, choir. Uh, choir, oh, ndio, yeah. yeah. Okay. So I jua nilikuwa natamani kwa ya but sasa voice. <laughs> okay, kwa na voice. Kwa na voice, yeah. ndio, yeah. but sasa... Now the musicality eh, na hiyo. Unaitoa. Ah, ilikuwa inanilemea sana. Unaenda auditions. Eh. Ta, makasi. Ukishajuju. Unaishuja <laughs> unamwa. Ah. Ah, I just let it go. Ako na soprano. <laughs> Not really. Eh. Since I'm at the one fair. Eh. Ni mtu ndo siko anatosha mboga. Hauko na talent. Yeah. Kuimba. Ya kuimba hiyo. <laughs> Even up to date mimi kuimba. <laughs> Kidogo ni chini. It's, it's not my portion. Okay, so from yeah. Chabakali where did you go to? KU. KU, yeah. what did you study in KU? I did microbiology, BSc mm -hmm. microbiology. Wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How was the experience in KU? Uh, sasa hapo, hapo ndo tulikuwa na conflict because I passed my KCSE. Okay. Nika mua, I want to do media, but sasa tunajua to the African mm -hmm. parents. The African parents. Iyo mambo ya, ah, we, the, <laughs> that sector is flooded, go and do um, this one because this is a marketable course. Microbiology. So ni mekuwa KU <laughs> but I've known uh, lecturers in the theater and arts department uh -huh. more than I've known the lecturers for microbiology. Oh. Una cause I related more na media because that's what was my passion. Mm -hmm. Yeah so it, 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 it but 
passion yangu ilikuwa kwa sana so okay. yeah hiyo ngine ilikuwa mzazi mm. but ni sawa mm. yeah. okay okay mzazi wazazi mnasikia <laughs> so uh, after you finished KU why did you start videography and photography in KU ama ulianza ulienda tena ukasoma tena professionally to enter into photography uh, photography mm. it was a mistake since my dear <laughs> siku taka hata okay siko ijua tunaweza piga picha ama siko sijai kuwa ana interest okay i used to do is an art all through ku act nini poetry nilikuwa mm. nikijita stage name program shairi nini na perform and all that mm. eh hey, so i wish kili hapo before uendelee hebu eh. tupigie shairi moja eh ah hey, so hawezi <laughs> tuambia wewe ni mshairi poet kwanza you may insist can you do for us maybe uh, just like a line or a, a verse Eh uh, okay. Inaweza kumbuka. Ah nakumbuka mombo. Oh, sawa. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Chapa, okay my chapa. favorite ni yeah. kuna moja inaitwa Kinole wacho ni just mm-hmm. someone mm-hmm. mtu ana anabembeleza yeah. msichana mpaka venye anampata and all ish, that nini nini. Come on give us that one kwanza <laughs> hiyo. <laughs> okay so eh ndege nimemkamata. Mm-hmm. Yuko kwangu sio siri. Mm-hmm. Binti nimemfumbata. Mm-hmm. Ah mistari na nipotea kidogo but mm. i had not reacted but, uh, but labda nikikumbuka kwanza hiyo Kiswahili bwana ah natupeleka pwani <laughs> but you will have to do that when we end the show Fikiri okay sawa acha nifikirie yeah. tukimaliza show Uta, i promise yeah. to give you yes shairi msijali ni venye sasa umeniambi ish nimekuambu eh yeah. haya <laughs> tumalizie so okay you ulikuwa unajua na, na lecturers wengi eh, wa wa theta nerds more yeah. than wa department ya microbiology yes Yeah. So you entered into photography by mistake. So mm-hmm. how was it? Uh, it was in 2020 corona ilikuja. Mm-hmm. Your lockdown everything okay. so hakuna uh, shows everything. Mm-hmm. Itu kila kitu imekuwa ni indoors indoors. Mlikuwa mnatapa shows kwa mashule. I used to do shows yes alafu pia there's this uh, thing that these people call jiggers. Jiggers. Hao ni just uh, okay hiyo ni slang but uh, mm-hmm. They are just train us in high school okay. and primary where by you aid the, gu- the girls and boys mm. to perform in the music and drama festival. Oh, nice. So it was a good hustle for us until uh, when the covid did come they were Everything postponed up to date. Unaona yeah. so kakwa ni hustle imeisha and you have to survive in this Nairobi. Mm. Uh, so nilikuwa I was in my house. Mm-hmm. Nilikuwa that was March uh, and March. Uh, March mpaka June. March mbaka June. Your jobless ya yeah, 2020. Mm-hmm. Your jobless hakuna ile savings zako zote nikao unapatia landlord yeah. and all that. <laughs> so there's a lakini ulalenge. Eh rora. Eh ulipe nyumba ndio upate malipo utakufia nje. Eh. Yeah. <laughs> eh. So uh, uh, there's a friend of mine and it's Mark. Uh-huh. Alikuwa yeye ufanya sana sana ndio alikuwa mambo ya recording and all that. Okay. See, by then milikuwa nikiona tu akifanya but zero interest mm. me i just wanted to be a performer not mm. someone uh, behind the knee mm. before the cameras ni okay. before man behind mm. mwenye anakuanga mwenye ana record sijui ni nani behind yeah. oh sawa yeah. oh before ni venye tuko hivi yes. haya sawa mm. eh so venye alikuja tuka akaniambia eh hey, bro niaje hii kamera yangu iko hapa kuna watu wanaichezea mm. so niketi kwa suitcase mali ndio because najua wewe naweza ku trust nayo mm. haitapotea yeah. e, na at least unajua so au upendi hizi vitu so hata sidhani utaitumia mm. so nikakaa nayo a month mm. kuna siku nikaamka asubuhi nikaangalia hivi nikasema ah labda naweza piga picha hata siko najua ni feature about it mm. eh ndio hapo ndo nikaanza kupata interest mm. nikamwambia Mark ni aje sunpati kamera yako basi mimi nifungue studio staying in one bedroom house okay. kamwambia hii sitting room yangu hivi mm. naweza kuwa nikipigia pigia hapa picha alafu everything iko hapa ndani mm. ni yake kwa bedroom huko hivyo so that tutakuwa na pigia hapa hivi oh, nice. but uh, nikifanya hivyo so naive mm. ningekuwa najua what photography entails mm. singefanya singefanya cause it's so expensive it's so exhausting mm. it's a venture in, in, in poor yes mm-hmm. but if you know what it takes to do photography unaweza ogopa si ati natishia mtu or anything mm. because mm. ile nye, if you want out to go professionally mm. so mm. i was so naive or so green about what is coming mm-hmm. ilikuwa tunafanya acha tuminifanye mm. all that just for fun yeah eh 
Mm-hmm. So tukaza kupiga picha hapo nikapeni tukuta white mm-hmm. eh nikatafuta ka stage kadogo hapo hivi mm-hmm. hizi mapalet hizi nikaunda mm-hmm. mbao mbao tu hapo kitu yeah. mtu kukalia nikaanza kupiga picha mm-hmm. so jeza mimi nikipiga picha mm-hmm. kwa macho yangu zilikuwa zinaka poa wow like so kikuja kwa reality <laughs> wow. compared to what others are doing yeah right yeah eh yeah. na yeah. how others hata mimi siwajui i don't care about them i'm just doing it such sija research nafanya tu mm. unafanya tu yes yes so until someone akakuja kaniambia hebu ende instagram angalie photographers wengine wanafanya nini mm. eh ndo nikiela nikaona we kumbe ukishapiga picha <laughs> unafaa edit mara yeah. sijui kuna lighting na nini hizo hizo yeah. vitu mimi sijui mimi kwa tu we simama cha eh. simama cha wow eh unapiga Una picha <laughs> eh <laughs> by then pia sia tilikuwa na leta do it was yeah. just uh, doing for fun not really for fun yeah. nilikuwa nafikiria kama eh hey, student studio eh hey, watu mm. watakuja kwa studio wakipiga picha tunaenda mm. kwa events tunapiga picha mm. alafu alikuwa na ile thinking ya tunaziosha tunuka printer tuweke hapo alafu tuze hang unaona <laughs> <laughs> because even the venue nilikuwa na think yes eh yeah. so kwenda hapo nika realize oh there's a lot i need to do mm-hmm. iki to see si venue tu watu wanaiona huko nje yes. ati utaza tu kupiga picha and that's all mm ndon career is just a career on its own ndo sababu watu wanaenda university wanasomea miaka 4 miaka 4 photography eh yeah. kupiga tu watu picha eh si ati ni kitu tu unezaamka tu ati i mean kwa na simu kali wacha tu nifanye you yes. can do that yeah. but if you want to do it professionally mm-hmm. it takes a lot of things very true eh mm-hmm. so that was uh, july 2020 eh ani kwa one bedroom nikafunga nikasema nika i was so ashamed after kuona vitu watu wanafanya because oh, i'm yeah. so good in poetry uh-huh. to a point that eh uko na level fulani nyumefika nyi if you do things you do it mm-hmm. at a certain level nyi ko poa sana Excellent. so if you are you're now trying something new mm-hmm. but ile level uko na compare to other people mm-hmm. unaona it's unmatchable uh-huh. eh mm-hmm. so nikafunga nikasema should i stop ama mm-hmm. nikafikiria maybe wacha basi nifanye kitu kingine I, I, i thought of opening up a laundromat Niko tu dobi basi juu nini nini eh hata ilikuwa nime design hizo vitu zote mm. cuz naona hii photography hii yeah. juu sijaisomea mm. wacha tu niachane nayo mm. then eh, kafika point kasema wacha niangalie tu youtube mm-hmm. ni nini okay ni nini photographers wanafanya mm-hmm. at least ni ndo nikaenda youtube mm-hmm. kuna ni eh, oh there's a friend of mine anaitwa Alan Alan. Eh Alan Keith yeye ndiye alinipia. Eh alikuniambia eh niaje naona unafanya ngapi picha? Mm. Siwaambie so, skipper mazao kufunza kupiga picha. Mm. There's a photographer called okay see tukiwa campus mazao kumita skipper but mm. ni wa lens photography. Okay. Simon Chege. Mm-hmm. Yeah of course eh, watu wengi wanamjua. Mm. So just hapo mi ah sina interest sana namjua kama rapper and all that but he bit ya photography sikuwa naijua mm. so nikampigia simu eh hey, skipper ni aje eh hey, mazee nataka kujua photography and all that rambia niko na youtube channel mm. just go to learning with lines on the channel yake mm. eh hey, uangalie tu hapo ma tutorials and mm. you learn something uh, alafu ndio uniambie kama bado utakuwa na interest mm. so sika kuwa ni kama ni manza sasa kosa fresh mm nikaandika program vizuri timetable nini and also mm. discipline to it wow nika learn photography for two months sasa ilikuwa ni august mm-hmm. eh, na september si ndio mm. eh so mwisho wa september uh, october october first ndo nika sana nikafungua sa studio tena nikafungua tena eh, sana nikasema eh, at least sana niko na knowledge kidogo mm. eh sasa ni ile ah wacha tu ni eh hey, wacha sana nifanye sasa tena nione how it will be mm. eh hey, nika at least alikuwa ni shadow you need some light strobes nini and all that bado sina doa kubai but at least mm. i know that that's what i need mm. eh hey. so nika kachukua ni hizo vitu zote nika set up studio mm-hmm. nikaanza tena okay. so hapo bado pricing ilikuwa chini ilikuwa nalipisha 200 bob unlimited mtu anakuja anapiga picha eh hey. picha 39 hey. <laughs> <laughs> <Like, laughs> eh hey. mtu akikupea punch una feel kama eh hey, mazee nime grow mm. bana eh hey, bana last mm. time tu alinipatia rwabe hizo mtu amenipatia punch mm. eh hey. cuz even i i remember at uh, kuna dem mm. alinita birthday yake kanipatia 1000 bob wow eh hey. mtu yangu nilipiga picha bana 
we i was so excited kumbe mtu anaweza eh hey. kulipesa yote eh hey, maze <laughs> okay see atido ilikuwa ni mingi i know i know eh hey, uh, because uh, but sasa oh so at least na grow una feel kama una grow eh hey. mm. so after hapo i got uh, my first job ilikuwa hiyo october october ikiisha mm-hmm. si ndio yeah. mm-hmm. ilikuwa sasa bado sasa ndio sasa ile unamalizia zile savings cause mm-hmm. i love saving a lot me okay. eh yeah. mm-hmm. So yeye saving kwa mbaki yote nikakuja nikanua ilikuwa 30000 mm. kumka nikaenda town mm. ile niuma hiyo pesa by the way ah. we <laughs> enda nikanua ka, eh ka background mm. eh ilikuwa background bili ya yellow na ya ni mm. yeah, it was orange shivi mm. ya orange kanua strobe mm. nikanua trigger kadogo nini mm. eh hizo anything the enye, ilikuwa anahitaji ilikuwa anamaandika list ya vitu zangu it mm. costed me around 33 because my brother aliniongeza 3k ju mm. ya yeah, so nika nika buy nikarudi kwa nyumba nimesota see anything but nikasema ah, let me just do this because ni maamu and there's nothing else i can do mm. unaona because mm. mimi saro yangu iko hapa na hapa ndio hata eh hey, acha tu mimi nifanye mm. so nika nikapiga shughuli december nini mm. then i was facing this challenge unapata Of course si kila mtu atakusupport kuna wale watakusupport yeah. na kuna wale watakoni mabishi zangu wananipigia sema eh hey, buda mazee unachoma kwa professionals mazee wewe wow. mazee hizi ni bei gani wow. unani wow. unalipisha unalipishaje shoot punch mazee mm. so jisa <laughs> mimi yeah. naangalia product na kupatia yes. na bei yes. unaona mm. siwezi kuambia ti ukikuja session yeah. nipatie 5000 mm. Like alafu picha na kupatia ni picha yenye ni worth 500 bob unaona yes. unaona mm. hapo inakuwa hiyo e, e, unakuwa con mm. inakuwa ni mbaya sana so mm. yeah, so hapo I mean, of course mimi nawalenga tu cause niko na target zangu mm. eh nazifanya tu pole pole na kuja naangalia the nights I've spent on YouTube mm. jumi photography mean me learn from YouTube no else mm-hmm. uh, after hapo ndo ilikuwa nienda kwa skipper mm-hmm. at least aye ndana nifunza vitu mbili tatu but basics and everything mm-hmm. ili learn from youtube hizo ma channel adorama tv mara sijui nini nini beyond photography all those channels me learn up hivyo mm-hmm. so after hapo ndo una realize ukishapiga picha kumbe pia nafaa u edit mm-hmm. mimi hiyo hiyo utero umekuja una save do nini nini una na by desktop hapo hivyo ndo uweke photoshop ndani you start editing mm-hmm. and all that mm-hmm. So ilikuwa hivyo. Mm. Ika grow, ika grow 2021. Ndoni mm. ka kutana na bishta yangu. Tulikuwa class by the ya, ya Simon Chege. Okay. So after class, tunikaa tuna the same direction, tunaenda same, same direction. Hapo mm. ndio Karelez pia ako na studio and is my neighbor. Okay. So tuka merge things. Alikuwa na lighting na nini pia mimi niko na zingine. Mm. So at least ikakaa ni studio kubwa because tume merge vitu. Yes. Wewe uko na mimi niko na stand mbili pia uko na mbili. So mtu aki client akikuja anaona ah lights ziko kwa stars ziko light nne. Mm. Unaona? Mm. So inakuwa ni at least studio iko poa. Mm. So inakupa hata time ya ku Eh inakupatia hiyo allowance ya ku grow because you au spend some money equipment mm. because at least ziko. Yes. So tuka work na yeye mpaka 2021 ikaisha. Okay. Eh, because agreement yetu ilikuwa ni Let's do it for a year ndio kila mtu ajijenge. Mm. So target yangu ilikuwa ni by the end of the year mm. lazima nikuwe na kamera yangu. Okay. Unaona? Mm. Because hiyo ndilikuwa challenge kubwa sana na face. Bado ulikuwa natumia kamera ya ule bishti yako flani. Okay, ilikuwa natumia hiyo but pia nafika point you need to hire. Oh, Unaona? Eh. Mm. So kisha haya mm. inakata sana kwa hiyo dongemeka. Mm. Eh unapata sana kwambie hii kamera nitakupatia na 2000 labda mm. ulie sana 1500 nitakupatia na 3k mm. eh so mm. eh, inabidi sawa na ngangana na hizo vitu zote but after that nilienda home kakalisha bro na my uncle's chini kwambie mm. niaje mm. i think mimi nimefanya issue guli for quite a, 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 some time mm-hmm. and i can get now my own camera mm. so hiyo nikwambia niaje mimi nahitaji munipatie do mm-hmm. i buy my camera mm. kanambia si atuweze kunulia camera you can loan you so that you buy alafu utatrudisha i so much appreciate cause we ili nifanya nika work hard jo nginipatia labda ninge relax <laughs> <laughs> so eh, ilikuwa ni eh, you pay back in form of rent wow okay niko na uh, my young sister ko campus mm-hmm. so ikakuwa ni you pay back in form of rent unamlipia rent eh mm. because that's the only way watani nitakuwa committed mm. 
eh, nilipe hiyo do mm. juu sasa mwezi kiisha wanakuja waambia ni aje wewe mwanzako ana atafungiwa nyumba bana si ulipe hiyo do yes. so ndio that's how i paid it alafu ikakuwa sawa okay. yeah so what drives you as a photographer your journey is very deep unapenda <laughs> that your, your 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 dream and your passion into photography ili kwa birth out of covid eh hey, maze <laughs> eh <Hey, laughs> you don't appreciate about covid cuz yeah. ili nifungua macho sana yeah. So yeah. what cut you out from the rest of the photographers now that ukianza ulikuwa mahali huko chini una charge 500 siku hizi red card imepanda juu ai japanda yeah. sana <laughs> <laughs> so as in what cuts you out what what would you say is unique about your kind of photography uh, unique 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 okay mm. you say unajua watu sema ti mtoto angalia kisogo cha mama yake si ndio mm-hmm. yes Of yeah. course uh, as a person you look at your mentor mm. na kuna vitu mingi sana utakopi yes. about uh, sure. your mentor si ndio mm. so me style yangu sana na na venye mimi upenda kufanya mimi mm. ufuata sana venye skipper yeye usema na and all that utapata mm. so hata venye eh, thinking yangu na how to do things mimi mm. uenda sana na line yake mm-hmm. si ndio eh, so basically hivyo ndo venye mimi napenda nikifanya kazi mm. at least i go towards direction yake so says mati there's something currently uh, enye in a stand out mm. about me enye inaweza kuwa ni far mm. from his way of doing things so of course jafika level yake whereby kuna quality anapiga enye siwezi piga mm-hmm. but at least i'm taking that direction okay, okay. yeah so kirenda service zako nataka tuende outside photography kidogo tu so, to talk as while well, the while well, the conversation is going on we'll be sharing some of the photos you've taken Uh, so ukirenda service zako za photography which is one moment for you unajua kume, umekuwa na zingine nyingi zenye umesha mention which is one moment that you can't forget that was the most embarrassing ilikuwa happen you ukiwa kwa shoot ama kwa event <laughs> ama anything you know wezi sahau embarrassing eh yeah. uh, sidhani ni kuna moment kubwa sana isha in happen here mm-hmm. Okay ilikuwa nikianza anza actually hiyo birthday yenye ilikuwa nenda yenye lipwa 1000 bob mm-hmm. eh kamera ilikataa to kufanya kazi jeez sasa napigia yo jamaa yeah. yana niambia eh hey bro <laughs> mio kamera hata mimi ni buy just to hide it out me i don't know much about cameras to... eh hey. what so kwa hapo sijui nitafanya aje and bado i'm so green na umehaya eh hey. <laughs> so unajua bado yeah. I don't know much about it. Yes, yes. Sasa nika, nikaenda kwa hizo menu settings nini nini kwanza nilitoa kadi because kuna zenye ilikuwa nishapiga. Mm. Mimi mali popote nitapata reset. Mm. Mimi ni reset camera. Sijui nilifinya wapi. Mm. But baada kutoa kadi nika reset mm. sikakuwa sawa ndikaanza kufanya. Nikaanza kujiuliza sasa ingekataa. Jeez. Wewe ingekuwa Ungefanya nini? Sijui. <laughs> Sijui hata ningefanya nini. Yeah. But I think uh, generally mm-hmm. okay venye mimi nimeona photographers wakiwa mm-hmm. alafu most of this wenye wenye unapata msi akianza mm-hmm. inakuanga challenge kubwa inakuanga ni planning okay. unapata either msi anafika set mm-hmm. amesawa either kubeba beti mm-hmm. ama kadi okay hizo ndio embarrassing moments ni muona photographers wengi wakipitia mm-hmm. so pata maybe umeenda place mm-hmm unapata fellow photographer anakuja kwambia eh bro ni aje mm. uko na za kuwa na kadi mbili unisaidie mm. una so vitu kama eh because hiyo sa kitu ndogo kama kadi mm. hauwezi shoot mm. uko na everything that you need to shoot but eh sa bila kadi sasa eh unaona mm. so i think uh, that's it oh, okay mm. so what would you advise maybe a young person or someone who wants to enter in the space here arts and especially photography Uh, alafu especially with the challenge that most wazaes don't allow guys to uh, or their children to enter into things like photography because the assumption is hii ni job by lip get uh. pesa inataka wapi atupiga watu picha <laughs> uh, most of the time kitambo ilikuwa nga studios ilikuwa kama zile zimeandikwa Kodak eh uh. alafu unaingia unapigwa kwa picha unatoka and it would be most of the time these jobs are going to be seasonal during christmas when people are taking photos events the, birthdays yes. pk yeah and if say the photography industry i believe it may change kidogo so unaweza advise aje mseka huyu eh ke kenyeza kushoto ni usiangalie kando mm-hmm. 
because mm. eh ukianza kuangalia ti watu wanafanya nini sana na unafanya nini mm. utakuwa discouraged because mm. at any given point there's someone better than you hata ukwe mnoma aje mm. utaparatu kuna tu, ule mse mwenye is doing better than you mm-hmm. so what you need to do ni gauge na scale yako okay. because eh, unapata mtu atakwambia we mm. usilipishe picha chipli mm. eh, mtu anakukataza <laughs> what i can tell you is mm. eh, angalia quality yako kazi unafanya mm-hmm. alafu because ini biz unafanya yes ujua una charge pesa ngapi mm. at some point mm. uta grow yes. unaona mm. shida tu inakuanga ni unalipisha chipli mm-hmm. alafu unabaki hapo mm. na kwa ni awe e, because ati ah mimi unajua sami nikilipisha chipli watu watakuja wengi hapana mm. mm. kuna mtu za mpative rate card ako aone ni kama uko serious mm. ati um, wedding how? video na photograph unalipa 10000 hapa mm. hawa mm. tatufanyia mchi wewe yeah. kukumele client atasema hapana wewe una sidhana hapa hawa tatupatia quality mm. so si atikulipisha cheaply mm. ndio solution mm. but angalia kazi yako mm. alafu nalipisha kulingana na eh can you never do then make sure that rate card yako ina grow kulingana na skill yako mm. uk increase skill mm. of course pia worth yako itapanda yes. tu unaona mm. so usiangalie mtu usiangalie jina nani anakuambia nini mm-hmm. achana na omse kwanza mm-hmm. build yourself mm-hmm. as a man or as a woman mm-hmm. eh kwanza uangalie last year nilikuwa hapa this year niko hapa yes. at least i'm better off yes. unaona mm-hmm. ukiangalia hivyo mm-hmm. uta grow but ukianza kuangalia kando mm-hmm. because uh, we come from different backgrounds yes alafu we have different abilities mm-hmm. kuna ule mse kamera yake ya kwanza it was just a professional camera mm-hmm. ya alipewa hivi from the word go eh hey, mm-hmm. akapewa na kila kitu mm-hmm. sio ukianza kujikompea na huyo mse stress itakupiga bure mm-hmm. unataka uangalie saa gadget unakuja unaona ati eh hey, mse yako na hii yako na hii yeah. inakupea stress eh hey, mbona mimi sina mm-hmm. anza na huyo yako ndogo mm-hmm. aku kanikon kadogo kakanon kadogo <laughs> yes skill yako ime grow yes. because eh unajua ukisha hiva hiyo ndogo uh-huh. ukipewa kubwa Definitely. you don't struggle yes yes, yes. yes. of course kamera kubwa ita inaweza overlook some things zenye kamera ndogo mm. inaweza in, fanya vitu, vitu fulani inaweza uh, overshadow hiyo lack of experience okay unaona mm-hmm. eh labda tuseme hauwezi fanya kitu fulani with this camera but ukipoa hii camera You can, be able to do you can do it so unajua hiyo performance inaendana na camera mm-hmm. but if you can work with this small one mm-hmm. now we'll achieve the best ah mm-hmm. uh, ukipewa kubwa au ukishapata hiyo kubwa au uh, unasonga tu ukienda okay. so focus on yourself nice nice tumeongelea photography sana mm-hmm. uh, so sasa nataka tufanye pop quiz this is just these are just basic questions about yourself are you ready ah uh, sawa so. question number one. what is your favorite food oh Tukisema leo hapa tunataka kufikia sembe ama ama nini what do you choose to eat really? samaki kwa nini oh kwa eh kwa sima kwa sima hiyo yeah. sawa hiyo ngo fresh kabisa okay number two, your favorite gospel artist uh-huh. in Kenya oh or beyond Kenya still eh sijui gospel is the gospel okay sawa uh-huh. sawa favorite mobile phone application Yenu natumianga sana Twitter Twitter Yeah Okay number 3 uh, a favorite hobby What else you enjoy doing apart from photography Carpentry Carpentry Yeah So unajua kutengeneza tengeneza vitu kwa mbao Yeah me uh, vitu za mbao napenda sana Oh nice Hata nice. nilibai hizo vitu ndio Time niko free uh-huh. At least I just make my vitu but za pallet sio okay. Si sophisticated oh. kama hizi. Okay, okay. Yeah. Favorite uh, movie. Uh, a thousand words. A thousand words. Yeah. Favorite pet and have you ever had a pet? I used to have a kapaka. Lakini mm. kali nisinya <laughs> jua manyoa. <laughs> kila ma- all kila over. manyoa kila ma- Eh hey, so yeah. ah because to grow home yeah. kulikuwa na kapaka so ah. Mm. Eh hey, ilikuwa penda ume grow na paka sana but so una realize eh hey, ina Nairobi na paka pia. Nikutriki. Ah acha tuikae. Eh. Okay. So tumemaliza pop quiz. Ah uh, uh, okay, the last question nimekumbuka ingine moja. Favorite destination. 
favorite destination? Is there a place you would want to go to, maybe place in Unatamani Kuenda and Njaienda? In Njaienda? Yes. Hey, sasa ni wafi. Wajua yeah. mimi spendi kusafiri sana. Upendi traveling? Ah, okay. Ila ni boat, I don't love traveling. Niki kwambia leo nataka kupeleka coast au tutaka kuenda? Uh, it depend. Yeah. It depend si at the end. Kwa to excited that it twende. Eh yeah. hey, it depend. Yeah. Naweza kubali ama naweza kata. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sawa sawa. So uh for someone maybe who is watching this show na anahitaji maybe ka inspiration or something unaweza wape unaweza mpea two parting shot on your camera just your parting shot eh hey. mm. mini photographer missy motivational speaker <laughs> I don't have to be a motivational speaker to to uh, or you can just give up a big up to maybe your ma, ma fans wako oh my big up friends eh hey. uh, big up to the CMG Posh Media Group <laughs> Of course hao ndo tutume grow nao sana kimziki, kisana. Yes. Yes. Kwa studio yetu tunafanya mziki, tunafanya everything shooting and all that photography so big up to super producer. Mm. Big up to LDC. Wewe ni msanii wetu pia so, eh, ni mm. Stitch Blaze and all those people mm. and of course big up to my mwalimu Mr. Simon Chege. Mm. Asante sana. Amenifikisha mbali sana. Mm. Eh na mimi mu appreciate sana every time I Nikipata yo chance ya kumappreciate I must appreciate him. Okay. Yeah. Nice nice. Na bado hatujasahau ulikuwa na shairi yetu. <laughs> <laughs> shairi shairi utanipea 30 seconds ni fikiria alafu yeah. ni. Napiga ubeti moja tu ama shairi lote. Ubeti moja niko sawa. Ubeti moja tu. Ah yeah, uh, sawa nipe 30 seconds nipange kwa kichwa alafu ni sema si ndio? Haya sawa sawa. Aya. Oh nikiwa nilikuwa na nilikuwa na introduction flani nilikuwa nikifanya Uwe shairi. Sao. This is your moment. Kwa ni kingia sel kwa na ingia hivi. Ato upicha ni mepentio kwa nyumba na ipenda sana. Aha. Kumbe mefika. Ni rogo mshairi. Kinole wacho hupata. Ndege ni memkamata. Yuko kwangu siyo siri. Binti ni memfumbata. Amemeza misitari. Hawizi kufurukuta. Huyu mtoto wa Nyeri kinole wacho hupata na hii ndiyo habari. Hey man 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 that is awesome. That is really really amazing. Kiswahili kimekukubali. Asante <laughs> asante. So uh, where can people find you on social media? Uh, I I prefer sharing my business account your yes. personal yo. Eh, si muda kwa mingi tu. <laughs> eh, CMG Posh Media, mm-hmm. Instagram CMG Posh Media, mm-hmm. Facebook CMG Posh Media, TikTok mm-hmm. CMG Posh Media, mm-hmm. YouTube. Kila kitu ni CMG, CMG Posh Media. Media. Website www.cmgposh.com. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much for coming to the show. It has been a great honor. Thank you. Tumefurahi sana kwanza hiyo shairi. Man. <laughs> That is really awesome. I wish I had that skill. Lakini ni sawa sawa. Nashukuru. Eh. So yeah. that was all from us here at Sanana Mitindo. Manze mumesikia hiyo shairi we Kiswahili kigumu na kwambia mwenzangu. Lakini that was all from us. See you next Wednesday right here on Weber TV every 8 p.m. For now, goodbye.